Hello traders, hello everyone. Welcome to Rally Academy's tutorial video series. And in this video, I'll be looking at how you can install MT4 or MT5 for your laptop. And of course, how you can also you know log into your account on both MT4 and MT5 and how you can separate more than one MT4, more than one MT5 for your laptop. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do as a trader is to go to our website, that's um, rally.trade. Once your page load, you will see this icon. That's the MT4 and the MT5 icon. Okay, so you can actually click on any of the two and install. Say, for example, you prefer MT5, you click on here and automatically uh, the software will automatically load and download. So you can see that it is installed downloaded to my laptop. And of course, I can view it if I choose. You can see now that if I want to view it now, I can just come around and you know click on this box and it will show me in the folder. And if you want to install MT4 also, just click on download and of course automatically mt4 is downloaded to your to your download folder now i'm going to be installing these indicators now that they are downloaded so what i need to do is to click on here and of course this will open up and i can see the download you know, file so i'll just come around and double click here if i want to install the mt4 first and of course i'll double click here now once i double click uh, this will come up i'm going to click on run to this part let me just minimize this I'm going to click on settings now. Uh, the reason why I'm clicking on settings is because I already have more than one MT4, you know, already installed on my laptop. So what I need to do now is to, if you don't, if you don't have any MT4 installed on your laptop, you can just go ahead and click on next. But if you have more than one and you want to separate the files, you click on come around here. Of course, you can name them. Okay, so let me just come around and say, okay, maybe uh, maybe MT4 Meta Trader. I can even change the name. Okay, Rally Trade. Uh, terminal okay, maybe six or something, right? Terminal six, and of course, I will on uncheck this so that it will not open automatically open the fresh, fresh web page for me. And of course, I can also change this one to maybe terminal six or something, six terminal. Then I will click on next. But before I do that, let me minimize this so that you can see what I have. So, right here, you can see that I already have one, two, and three empty four terminals. On my laptop so uh, i want to install the fourth one okay now if i click on install directly automatically the mt4 will install on, or directly on top of one of these ones so but i don't want that to happen so i want it to be separate mt4s on my laptop so let me go back to what i was doing right here so now i can click on next and of course this will automatically install on my laptop now i'm going to be you know, copying and pasting my password Okay, as I move on, so once this one loads now, I can log into my account on MT4. This is the way you do it. This is the best way to do it. So once this is done, it will give you finish. Like, can you see finish here? So just click on finish. And automatically, you just hold on for a second. Okay, so now uh, the MT4 is installed correctly on my laptop. And now I can log in to my account. Now, all you need to do, when it gets to this stage, you need to just do something. You just need to click on cancel. I prefer this. Just click on cancel. And this will come up. So if it is demo account you want to log into, automatically you already have a demo server here. Just copy in and just copy in your demo information. If it is real account you want to log into, you need to select right here. You select real. And of course, you can copy your login information. But of course, let's say that I want to start with demo. So I'll just click on demo now. And now I'm going to copy in my login. Now your login is directly on your mail book. Once you have prepared your account and you, you know open maybe your demo or your real account, automatically the login information is going to be on your mailbox. So you need to go to your mailbox and search it up and bring it in here and the login is going to be your account number and the password is going to be your password. So let me copy mine and bring it here. Give me a second. Okay, so now I have copied in my account number and the next thing I want to do is to paste my password. Now, this is for demo account, so I'm going to do Control V to paste that. And now I will log into my demo account. Now, once you log into your demo account, uh, automatically you hear that sound that comes up. That sound is to confirm to you that that account is properly logged in. And of course, you will be, yeah, that's to welcome you to you know your MT4 properly. And now you can see that you have your account number here. That's the account, and of course, the amount you show. And of course, now the account is showing you can see that I have um, uh, some money that can. It's actually a demo account. Where you are going to that is very important to you is the trade part. So you come to trade, and of course, you can see the amount in your account. Okay, then you can log in. Now, let's say that um, I've logged in properly. 
Okay, so one thing I normally do once I log into my account properly is to close all the pages here. It's very important to do that. So you close all the pages on your on your screen. Now that's the default thing that came with it. Of course, you, the next thing I want to do that is very important is to right click on market wash and click on show. Sure. It's very important you do this. Then, by all means, you can you know come around here to this button. This create a new chart, and of course you can come around and pick whatever you want, whatever you know instrument you want to trade. Mm -hmm. Say for example. Want to trade currency? You go to major, okay. So when you get to major, you can pick any currency you want. For example, maybe you want uh, maybe USD JPY, okay. And of course, if you want Euro USD, Euro USD has some folder on this account. So you come around here and you select Euro USD, okay. So you can double click now to you know actually expand the pages. Now uh, I also I also like to uh, by all means you know format my page to reflect the background that I prefer. But if you want more of this, you can actually contact us for you know more templates we can use for you. Now, this is the general button that goes to templates. Okay, this is not this, this is not the training for how you use the default. Let me just quickly introduce you to the template, you know, button. So you come around here and you can click on any template, uh, any template you, you prefer to use. Okay, so but for more information on the you know, templates you will use, Rally Rally Trade actually have so templates already prepared for you. Okay, so you can contact us for those. We will not give you more. But this is how you install MT4 on your laptop. Of course, if you want to log into more than one account on your MT4, you can now, for example, you want to log into your real account, you click on file. Very important. You click on log into trade account. Okay, this is where I do it. Of course, you can copy in your real account information. So give me one minute, let me copy in my real account information. One second. I'll type in my real account information, 95. Then two nine, and I'm going to paste my password in your presence, and I will need. Let's see, this is very important. You necessarily need to change your your server to real server. It's very important you do this for real account. Then you can click on login. Now, once your account is properly logged in, you will see. For example, uh, you can see now that I have some trades running on my account. It's my real account, and of course, if you log into your real account and you see your pages faint like this one, as you can see now, all you need to do is to come around here. Okay, right click again. It's very important on each account to right click. You click on sh uh, show all, and of course, you can now begin to open fresh pages for the accounts. Okay, so I'm going to come around here now. For example, if I want maybe Euro USD, I'll pick this, and of course, I can close all these ones now if I prefer. Okay, I can close the pages that I don't need if I prefer. Uh, one way of closing that. Okay, and then uh, if I want to see the, uh, the account that's currently running, I think it's US 100, so I'm going to come here. And pick US 100 so I can see all the trades running on this account. So, this is the way you do it. And this is the way, this is actually the way I prefer to do it. Okay, so you can, you know, pick on anyone. Um, more details on how to format your pages and how to add indicators to this chart is going to be, you know, shown on another video that will be coming up shortly. Okay, so now let me just play you this opportunity to just explain how you do MT5. It's almost the same thing. Okay, so you come to, let me just go back to my download pages go back here and pick mt5 so i'm going to double click now uh like i said before because i have an account already okay on mt5 so i'm going to show you how you can actually navigate and still open another account on mt5 of course it, it will still be fine so i'm waiting for this to load okay so i'm going to click on run so i'm going to click on settings and now i can pick I can write anything here, maybe 10 or something, just to differentiate the folders. So I can also write 10 here if I choose. And then I can uncheck this button so that it doesn't open the web page for me. Now, it's not as if you leave it, it's just open the web page, just need to close it. There's no issue there. Then you click on next. Just a few seconds more. And now it's ready. So you click on finish. And when you click on finish, this will load automatically. Uh, and of course, your new MT5 terminal just come up. And of course, you can use it as you like. So this is uh, what you do. So now it is asking you to just connect your account. So give me a second while I copy my login information. Then one five. And now I'm going to paste the password. And so I'm going to click on finish. Now you can see this and Of course, remember uh, when this is done, you can always, if you need to, you can always go to your registration. Okay, click on it, and of course, your password and account number is going to show. So, let me click on trade, and now you can see that I also have some trades here. This is live account. Okay, so, and remember, 
you can close all these four pages you can close all these ones if you like and now you can easily you know open a fresh page by clicking on here right click and click on show all it's very important to do that then you can now click on file open chat and you can go to any chat you want under standard pick any chat you want under here for example if you want cool lawyer you can pick on it and of course you can double click to the preview cool lawyer and before you place a trade on your account remember you need to go through training it's very important then you also need to uh, install some templates that we normally give so we, we always do that right so the, but this is the way you do this one now that you are logging to your account you can also log into another account because your account is going to show on that account here okay so you can always log into another account on your terminal okay so just click on here and of course your account will show okay so if i just click on here now that drag up and i click on here my account number will show okay so um it's very important to do that very very important you do that right now let's go to the next one say i want to log into more than one account okay i'll click on file and of course i'll click on login to trade account and i'll pick another account number so let me give me a second let me copy my second account number okay so now i'm back six four zero five of course i'll log in so uh now i can always you know do whatever i want with the account so i have two accounts running uh account one if you want to, if you want to switch between the accounts you can easily come here okay and switch between the accounts that you want to switch say for example you want to i want to switch to the former account i'm going to just come around here and stop it. This is how I do it okay so that's that one as simple as that uh, thank you very much you know and of course if you go to your before i close let me go to my desktop you can see my desktop now and you will see that i have mt5 here that's the one i just loaded now and i also have mt4 there now these two did not disturb the previous mt5 that i have this is the previous mt5 that i have and of course these are the previous mt4s that i have okay so if i want more remember you go to settings and of course you can change the configuration of the directory folder so that you can have more than one mt4 not interfering with the previous one on your mt4 okay on your desktop mm -hmm. thank you very much for staying with us in this video of course i'll see you in the next video Thank you.